What's good, sneakerheads? Back here with another one, and this one is making my day great. I've been waiting on these for a minute. Um, I got them from this dude. I'm going to shout him out real quick. I'm going to have his name here so you can see it down in the description, too. I'll have a link to his Kixify so you can see what he's got. Um, his Kixify name is j 2 da 3 underscore NT right there. And his Twitter name uh, kind of long, so I'm just going to throw it up right here. But Homeboy has some great shoes for some great prices. He hooked this up last minute. I already had somebody lined up for it. You know, I tried through the sneakers app like I'm sure everybody did, didn't get them. Um, I had somebody lined up to get them, but there was some miscommunication, so that fell through. And Homeboy came in with a clutch. He got me for a great price. Um, I got them fast. But uh, because of how quick he was moving things, he just kind of grabbed the package, thought it was the right size, and sent it out to me without opening it. It was the wrong size, so um, he actually shipped me the right size before I sent out the size back to him. So he's extremely trustworthy. Um, you know, we got everything straightened out and I just got the right size in today. So I'm doing the video on it now. And these shoes are so hyped. I love these shoes. Like, I, these are probably the best ones for me this year. Because y'all know how much I love iridescent. Yeah, that that's what these are. And that right there will give you a hint right there. So, to open it, I have my American Airlines Advantage card. You know, got to get them frequent flyer miles. So, uh, let me, I gotta scratch this real quick so I can, uh, make sure my address is off of it, <laughs> just in case, you know, there's some crazy people out there. Um, alright, well I'm gonna have to do this from the bottom, cause, uh, you know, it's covering, so I won't be able to get through it with this dull ass credit card. And, you know, I got my stuff blocked, so you can't see it. You can't use my stuff and get my miles and everything. So, let's hope it's sharp enough to get into this. It is. Oh, God. I haven't even looked at these. Like, this is the uh, first opening, so, um, you know, if they're the wrong size again, uh, no excuse, but I doubt it because homeboy is cool. So I know he's smart. He didn't do it. He actually looked at these before he shipped them out. So let's go, let's go. I can't wait. Size 12. Ha ha. Bang, bang. Right here. These are the 97 Air Max Ultra London Marrakesh. These are the uh, Skepta uh, Nike collaboration. I love these from first sight. Like seriously, these shoes are amazing. I, I, I just can't get enough of them. And the box with that Moroccan look to it, you, you, can't, you can't beat it. And it's kind of funny too, I actually have a t-shirt that has this exact same setup on it. Black with like the, uh, the shiny black Nike thing. It's a bad shirt, love it. Got it from my uh, black Vapor Maxes, but you know I'm not wearing those that much because I got a little, I got a lot of stuff to go through and boost his life still. But I, I have a feeling I'm gonna be wearing these a lot. So let's get into this and see these babies. I didn't want to open up the last one, the size 11 that he sent, because I didn't want to like hold them. I'd be like, I don't want to send them back, you know, and uh, I wouldn't be able to do anything with an 11, so I just didn't open them. I, even the paper, the paper even has that Moroccan print on it. Oh, these are so much better in person. Oh God, these things look so nice. Bang, bang, bang. There you go, there's this beauty. God, these things are amazing. I love the way these look. Oh my God. Shoegasm, you know what I'm saying? Get 
that out of there. You know, that kind of hurt me throwing that box. Is how nice that box looks. All right. Yeah, these, uh, there's a lot that actually went into these. Um, you know, these are based after the 1999 Air Tuned Max. Uh, they were the first Nike shoe that he personally went and bought. And it had the same colorway on it. Uh, I'll put a picture up right here. Um, they actually look kind of bad, you know. I mean, I wear them, but these look better. These, I'm glad that they chose this style to go with. Um, as you know, everybody knows, uh, the OG Air Max 97s were real tight, you know, like I had a pair of the silver bullets from back in the day and it was so uncomfortable to wear those just because of how tight they were. Like I, it just wasn't good. Um, but these ultras that they came out with, I think they realized that and they changed the form a little bit. They changed, you know, the make and everything. So, um, these are actually kind of comfortable, you know, I mean, I would still recommend going about a half size up, uh, just because they are a little snug, but it's a running shoe technically. So, you know, they have to be a little bit snug. Um, the bottoms of these things, oh God, the design just goes through and through on these. Um, for those of y'all who don't know, Skepta is a UK rapper. Um, he's kind of like a, grime artist so um that's kind of like a uk it's real popular over in the uk um and these are also made to celebrate the 20th anniversary of the nike air max 97 so i think they did a hell of a job to go on through that you know uh, to make these for that um the color combos are just absolutely phenomenal. Like the golden, like the orange, yellow that goes in right here in the bubble. The green right around here, the iridescent, like green and gold, especially right here on the tongue. And, uh, you know, the green base with like the rose gold, copper rose color that goes around here. All this right here is like a polyurethane. They technically call it... Um, copper rose gold or something like that um then you got the black mesh that kind of lines in between right here and god it also has a new style of um the nike check right here this is called a uh, hf welded logo and i think i think it's it's great even the back right here this is braided like it's got that Moroccan look to it even with this he was heavily inspired um, when he went on vacation to Morocco and that was technically his adopted home uh, <coughs> Skepta he just loved the Moroccan culture so he wanted to incorporate that in the shoe and it's even down to the insole if you can see that I'll even throw a picture up just in case you can't see it. But uh, it's got the Moroccan feel that was on the paper. And that SK logo that's right there is supposed to resemble a British power plug. So that's pretty cool. I even like, I mean, right here on the laces, it even has that braided look for the lace lock going down the middle of it. I absolutely love these shoes. Like the colorway is me all together. I'm not, you know, for the pink stuff and whatnot, but this, I, I, I think I could pull it off and a lot of people could. Uh, let me know in the comments, you know, did y'all like this shoe? Cause as soon as I saw it, I fell in love with it. Like I had to have it. Um, same thing with the new one that's coming out. And I'm also gonna cop that from the same dude. The um, black, undefeated one that's kind of got the Gucci look with the blue and the red going or the green and the red stripe going around it and the all black gotta have that because you know black <laughs> uh, you know I got the blue on today to match these but typically all black so that's just how I am love neutral colors always have but these same thing iridescent glow in the dark black that's me all the way. Iridescent number one, glow in the dark number two, black number three. 
Got them glows right here. Got some more glows down there. Gotta have it. You know, gotta have it. God, I love this shoe. I'm gonna have some on feet. These probably look amazing on feet. Um, and I'm sure they are just as comfortable as the other ultras that are out there. And if you guys tried the originals, like the OGs, and just didn't like them, so you gave up on the Air Max 97, go out and try the ultras. I guarantee you, you will notice a big difference between the two. <coughs> like, I guarantee you. And you might actually jump back into the bandwagon. So, you know, if you, somebody bought you some, something like that, you go try them on. But, uh,. Yeah, let me know what you think about this shoe down in the comments. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. I can't wait to get these on my feet, so I'm going to go do that now. Um, you know, I'm going to have some nice pics at the end of this video. Um, you know, the on feet, everything like I always do. So stay tuned for that. I uh, hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, let me know what y'all think. Are y'all going to cop these? Did you cop these? Are you going to cop the undefeateds that drop? Um, and yeah, hope y'all have a good one. Peace.